Welcome! In this video I'm going to be taking a look at this Lano USB Bluetooth adapter. So this was provided to me by the distributor, but they're not compensating me for this video and they're not reviewing it before I post it. If you find this video helpful and you want to purchase one of these, I'll put a link to it in the description on Amazon. And if you use that link, it helps me out a little bit and doesn't cost you anything extra. So this supports Bluetooth 5.1. So there are a couple different uses for an adapter like this. One would be if your computer doesn't have Bluetooth on it. So this is a way to add Bluetooth. Another would be if your computer has Bluetooth, but maybe you have an older version and you want to take advantage of some of the things of the newer version of Bluetooth. So Bluetooth 5.1 is going to be faster, have lower energy requirements, be more reliable than Bluetooth 4 or previous versions. So using an adapter like this, you can do things like add a keyboard and mouse to your computer, add different Bluetooth peripherals, do Bluetooth audio. So Bluetooth is becoming pretty ubiquitous these days for connecting things to your computer. So let's get this out of the box and look at it. So here's our warranty card here, and here's the adapter. See if there's anything under here. There is something under here. Okay, the manual. So this came with a little lanyard you could put on here. We'll stick that in through the loop. There we go. So this does have a little cover for the USB. So if you keep this in bag, it's protected. So let's take a look at the manual here. So it comes with USB adapter, manual, and the certificate. The specs is product model LCB6051B. Bluetooth protocol is A2DP, HSP, AVR, CP, HID, PAN, GAV, DP, DID, and IOPT. So I don't claim to know what all those protocols are, but you can look them up if you're not familiar. The frequency range is 2400 hertz to 2486.5 hertz. System support is Windows 8.1, 10, 11, that's drive free. Windows 7 requires a driver installation. So it talks about that here. Here's some different tips on the back. It says when connecting the Bluetooth device should be placed near the product and effective distance cannot exceed 20 meters. Here it says it is recommended no more than five types of Bluetooth devices such as mouse, keyboard, gamepad, speaker, Bluetooth headset are connected to this product at the same time. So you can read through the rest of those. So I do have a computer that does not have Bluetooth on it. So I'm going to get that up on my bench here and I'll plug this in and we'll test it out. Okay so I'm logged into Windows 10 here and I'll take the adapter and I'll plug it into the back of the tower. Okay, in the bottom corner here, it says setting up a device or setting up Bluetooth radio. It says device is ready. Bluetooth radio is set up and ready to go. So that was super easy to set up. I pretty much didn't even have to do anything. I just plugged it in. So now I want to set up a Bluetooth device. So I'll go into settings. The easiest way is to just type Bluetooth here. It says Bluetooth and other device settings. I'll open that. So I'll hit add Bluetooth or other device. I'll hit Bluetooth, mice, keyboard, pens, audio, or other kinds of equipment. I'll tap that. So here I have a Bluetooth keyboard. I'll turn it on. Then I'll press one of the Bluetooth buttons and I'll hold it down to turn on pairing mode. So now I'm in pairing mode. We can see BT 5.0 keyboard. I'll tap that. It says the device is ready to go, so I'll hit enter on the Bluetooth keyboard. Now I want to say add Bluetooth or other device. Again, I'll tap the same thing. I'll be pairing the mouse. I'll turn it on. Bottom here, I'll switch to Bluetooth mode. That might pair, let's see. I'll hold it down. Okay, we're in pairing mode. I'll choose BT 5.0 mouse. And now it's paired. I'll hit this again. Here I have some headphones. I'll turn these on. So the headphones are in pairing mode. We have Bluetooth audio headset. It says Techno Nightingale N1. I'll tap that. Connected. And now it says connected. So I'll hit done. And there we have three devices connected to this. We have the headset, we have the mouse, and we have the keyboard. So that's the Lano Bluetooth 5.1 USB adapter. If you need to add Bluetooth to a computer, this is a super simple way to do it. With Windows, you just plug it in, it automatically configures itself. Then you go into your Bluetooth settings, you can easily add keyboards, mice, speakers, game controllers, you name it. The nice thing about this is that you don't have to open up your computer to install it. You can just plug it into one of your USB ports and then you can move it around to different computers too. Say you go to a computer lab that doesn't have Bluetooth, you could plug this in if it gives you permission and you can connect up your Bluetooth headphones to it or something. Thing. And then when you're done, you can take this with you. So that's all I'm going to cover in this video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.